In this clip I'm going to show um, how to deal with the problem of finding the equation of a line parallel to a given line through a given point. So uh, this example has starts with this line which as in the previous video has equation 2x minus y equals 3. And this uh, dashed line is the line parallel to it going through the point 1, 3 and we need to see how to find its equation. Uh, um, now, the, uh, let's have a look at the conventional method. Uh, in the conventional method, we, we have the equation y equals mx plus c, and uh, this equation here is y, is, uh, y equals 2x, 2 being the gradient, minus 3, the value of c is minus 3 down here somewhere. So, uh, the way it works conventionally is that we are looking at a line going through the point 1, 3 and we know that it is y equals 2x plus some value of c which we've got to determine. So you substitute in these two values for x and y into this equation 3 equals 2 times 1 plus c and solve this for c, c equals 3, take away 2 is 1 and then substitute back this value of c into the uh, temporary equation here. So y equals 2x plus 1. That's uh, relatively simple, but uh, doesn't really reveal the uh, much of the maths behind this. Uh, in this equation, the general form of which is ax minus by equals c, that c is not the same as that one, um, these two coefficients of x and y, a and b, give you the, uh, well, their ratio gives you the gradient of the line, a over b. And so this left-hand side of the equation uh, tells you about the gradient of the line. And the right-hand side tells you about the position of that line, of any line parallel to this one. So this, this side of the equation is called the general side. All lines parallel to this one will have this on the left hand side. And this side of the equation is called specific. So we have um, now all to do, the only thing we need to do is to substitute in this 1 and 3, x is 1, y is 3, into the left hand side of the equation. 2x minus y, in order to obtain the right hand side. So it's two ones take away three, which is minus one. And that's the one line method uh, from weighted mathematics.